White House bars the Times and other news outlets from the press briefings. Hello everyone, Jen here, Golden State Times, and today we have a news story. This one comes courtesy of the New York Times, actually. And it says, journalists from the New York Times and several other news organizations were prohibited from attending a briefing by President Trump's press secretary on Friday. A highly unusual breach of relations between the White House and its press corps. Reporters from the Times, BuzzFed News, CNN, and the LA Times, and Politico were not allowed to enter the West Wing office of the press secretary, Sean M. Spicer, for the scheduled briefing. Aides to Mr. Spicer only allowed in reporters from handpicked groups of news organizations that the White House said has been previously confirmed. The news organizations included Breibart News, the One America News Network, and the Washington Times, all with conservative leanings. Journalists from ABC, CBS, The Wall Street Journal, Bloomberg, and Fox News also attended. Reporters from Time Magazine and the Associated Press, who were set to be allowed in, uh, chose not to attend the briefing in protest of the White House's actions. It says that nothing like this has ever happened at the White House in our history of covering multiple administrations in different parties. It says that the executive editor of the Times said in a statement, he went on to say, quote, we strongly protest the exclusion of the New York Times and other news organizations. Transparent government is obviously of, cru of crucial national interest. The White House uh, Correspondents Association, which represents the press corps, quickly re rebuked the White House's actions. And it says that the WHCA board is protesting strongly against how today's gaggle is being handled by the White House. The association president, Jeff Mason, said in a statement, quote, We encourage the organizations that were allowed in to share the material with others in the press corps who were not. The board will be discussing this further with White House staff. So it couldn't come soon enough. Um, the, the New York Times needed to get booted off since the very beginning. They do nothing but do hit pieces, slander, hit pieces, lie and lie and lie again about President Trump. They're the opposition party, along with CNN, along with BuzzFed, um, which I always thought that BuzzFed was kind of like People Magazine, to be honest. I never, I don't know who can take BuzzFed seriously when it comes to politics. BuzzFed is like the onion, you know, but uh, I guess they had somehow press passes. Um, who else was on there? Oh, the LA Times, <laughs> go figure. They're, they're probably worse or the same as the New York Times. Um, but I'm pretty, I'm, I'm actually glad that Press Secretary Sean Spicer stood up and said, you know what, we're kicking these guys out because they're just taking up space. They're not doing anything productive. They're not here to listen. They're just here to do gotcha questions. They're just here to slander and they're just here to deceive and, uh, you know, switch the, the, the narrative around and fit it their own to their own agenda and um, it was time for them to go. And I hope that this is permanent that way it can it, it can be a, a lot more productive uh, press briefings than just, you know, these lying media asking about Russia every single chance it can possibly get. But let us know what you guys think in the comment section below. Also, check out our other channel, Golden State Times International, for all of your international news and also streams. Thank you very much for watching. See you guys soon. Peace. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Let us know what you guys think in the comments section below. Give this video a thumbs up and share it on social media. Check out our previous videos that should be coming up on the right side of your screen. Click on them, they're interactive. They'll take you to the video you might wanna watch. Give it a thumbs up and share it while you're over there. Check out the links in the description below. If you are new to our community, we encourage you to subscribe by clicking the red button below the video or the Golden Globe they'll be coming up on your screen. We welcome you and hope to see you guys here next time. But until then, peace.